Good morning. Forty-four kilometers today. Let's go. Two minutes in, and I'm already. If I wasn't two minutes in, I'd walk through that, but I guess I'll go back and walk up there. I gotta take a leak. Four kilometers of floodway walking. PCT ain't got shit on this. So many options. You're going that way. I ain't slowing down. You have to give me a ticket if you can catch me. to St. Rolf. So I just stopped at that uh, the radio tower, whatever that is, on their property, well, in the, in the road allowance. Basically the, the approach that goes over the ditch onto that property. Just to have a quick little 10 minute bite to eat. Put some peanut butter on a wrap. Stretch my back out again. Because like clockwork, I could set my freaking watch to my back. Two hours in, my back just started killing me. Anyways, my thoughts on the trail so far. So far, it's not a trail. It's a route. It's been 12 or 13 kilometers so far of road walking. From what I can tell, all the way to San Adolph, it's road walking. From San Adolph. Up to Neverville, I think is road walking. Through Neverville, I think it's like cute little town park pathways, I think. And then to Mennonite Landing will be road walking. Lots of road walking. This is a route so far, not a path, not a trail. I'm still enjoying it though, regret nothing. Okay. 
This is Highway 210. That's St. Adolf. We're going this way one mile and then, <laughs> then we go west to St. Adolf and hike a bullshit 12 kilometers around St. Adolf and then come back out over here again a mile further down this road. <sighs> Bullshit miles, I think. I could skip 12 kilometers if I just keep walking that way. The trail meets up again down there. Another mile. But no, I'm a fucking sucker for punishment. So I'll go walk a bullshit 12 kilometers around that way and then come back over. Look, it's Highway 210 again. We have successfully backtracked and we're still going. The only time you should cross the same point is when you switch backs up a mountain or you're crossing a meandering river and you have to keep crossing the river. You should never have to backtrack and cross the same point for no reason other than to maybe not hurt the feelings of the town of St. Agath for not including them in the construction of this trail. It is a cute town though. Give it that. Oh, we're going up here on top of the bank. This is where the poor people live. They couldn't even afford to fill their pool. These guys had to use rocks because they couldn't afford real building materials. It's a shame. I just feel so fortunate when I'm walking through these slums. I'm just happy about everything I have and everything I'm able to do. <laughs> well, we're at the, the first real trail part of the hike. I had to go 12 kilometers out of the way to get it. But it's kind of trail-y. I guess. St. Adolf's just over there. It's nice so far. go. This is weird as shit. I don't know if it's part of the trail, but and I'm walking through it. Oh, this would be an awesome place for lunch. I don't even know if I'm on trail yet.
I, uh, there's no signs. The app says to go that way. I don't know what side of the, this drainage ditch I'm supposed to be on. The bridge is out, so I guess I'm gonna go on this side. Oh, it's lovely. It's sleeping. That's Niverville. There be civilization. Oh, oh. hello. Ah. sit down here for a hot minute and enjoy the rest of my Gatorade that I purchased at Shell. Right in front of the, <clears throat> sorry, Niverville Golf Course. Sit here for a hot minute, rest my feet. Got about nine more kilometers to go, I think.